Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome to a brand new YouTube video. Hope you guys are all doing great. Today guys, we are going to be talking about the possibility that Capcom could announce Resident Evil Village DLC at Tokyo Game Show. This is coming from altchair.com. I hope I'm saying that right. But essentially they posted an article that goes over some leaked information essentially that stems from 4chan now i do want to preface this in the very beginning please take everything with a grain of salt don't get your hopes up too high and please be skeptical of everything that you hear in this video because i'm not even sure um i do make these types of videos so if you do go on to enjoy please subscribe and leave a like and put notifications on so you guys don't miss a video uh again this video is overdue i tried making this with a face cam but oh my gosh it looks so wonky and it looks so bad and i just did not have the time to make that so i'm literally filming this a, a, like an hour before i had to work so i hope this is out in time but um i hope i'm not late on this video but yeah i'm not gonna make this video too long the article goes on to say alleged schedule of capcom's tokyo game show presentation has surfaced via 4chan their schedule includes resident Evil village dlc reveal as well as pragmata gameplay for that i don't know what pragmata is or pragmata whatever that says i don't know what that is supposed to be but Resident Evil Village DLC sounds very promising. <laughs> Again, keep everything with the take everything with a grain of salt. The Japanese developer and publisher Capcom will be pre present at the upcoming gaming expo Tokyo Game Show, which kicks off at the end of September as expected. Game uh, Capcom did not reveal their lineup of games that will be appear, but have at the event but apparently the full presentation has surfaced online via the controversial message board 4chan everything has leaked essentially uh given that 4chan is the source of leaked schedule we strongly suggest that you take everything with a dose of skepticism with since most 4chan leaks turned out to be fake they've even said themselves take everything with a grain of salt allegedly here is the picture so you guys can see like this is the picture that they're talking about um you can see it on screen i'll have it better for you guys in just a moment so you guys can like see what it actually does like say because it, at first glance you guys are probably like what is this michael like oh yeah i'll, I'll put it up on you for you guys on screen because it's been translated all right okay so here's the actual like what it is so i showed you the picture of it um and that's all like the leaked and stuff and then enhanced like so this is what we see ip showcase opening video resident evil village dlc teaser trailer plus dev interview resident evil reverse trailer plus release date resident evil merchandise promotion resident evil welcome to raccoon city video resident evil 25th anniversary special announcement and then it just goes on to say some other stuff related to capcom's lineup of games which i don't want to talk about because it is not relevant to my channel now Let's talk about the first one, Resident Evil Village DLC teaser trailer plus dev interview. Now, I'm going to start off with the dev interview first because this is kind of relevant because every single DLC trailer that we've gotten up to this point for Resident Evil Village has had a dev interview, which is really insane. They really do, they really are proud of this game, you know, the amount of time and detail this game has, they were really, they really liked, so they emphasized that a lot. Now, the teaser trailer, I'm happy they're finally making this more relevant because essentially back when they first announced the dlc uh i think we think it wasn't gamescom i think it was e3 but back at e3 or i forgot what game event it was but essentially back when they announced it they didn't really show us gameplay they didn't give us any details but they just confirmed that yeah we're working on dlc you know yeah hey, you're gonna get dlc soon but after that we got the r reverse teaser trailer or I'm not teaser trailer, the reverse trailer plus release date. Now that's good, that's good, that's good. We're finally getting a release date and trailer. You know, they've shown us enough gameplay and trailer. It's been long overdue, it's been delayed a couple of times. No more holding back, Capcom. Just release it, let us get into it and play. I hope it's not an entirely disappointing thing. I really hope it's full content and it's really good because Lord knows that the last multiplayer game that they released which was uh i can't remember it was with resident evil 3 i forgot what it was called but resistance uh that wasn't bad but it, w it wasn't good either no it wasn't good either. and resident evil merchandise promotion i don't really know what that means i mean like that could be a lineup of other stuff that pertains to resident evil uh merchandise i'm not really too sure about that resident evil welcome to raccoon city i'm not gonna talk about and then resident evil 25th anniversary special announcement now that could be what they were talking about in that one tweet with the 25 years of resident evil that other 
leak or not leak but it was coming straight from capcom and it was that tweet it was the it uh spicy and all that it was like the resident evil one like it was something pertaining to resident evil one uh it was a tweet I'll, i think if i have it i'll put it on screen but if i don't then i'm sorry but uh yeah that other than that guys i mean that's pretty much gonna have to wrap up today's video one thing that i do want to know is resident evil outrage is not on here and i'm hoping that is it is going to be announced with that nintendo e the nintendo direct event i'm hoping it's announced from there but i'm gonna hold out hope other than that guys that's essentially gonna have to wrap up today's video i hope you guys definitely did enjoy and i will catch you guys in the next video thank you guys so much for watching see you guys then